Man, oh man, guys, we got another treat today. We got another one that I was not expecting to show up and basically do this again. I don't understand why this is still a trend here on YouTube, why people are really pulling this kind of content off, but you guys know about those FaceTiming people, all oh, they're alive, they answered must watch, 3 a.m. kinds of videos. They're pretty much everywhere. Every time somebody passes away, you're gonna have a couple dozen of these people, maybe even more than that. Maybe I'm really lowballing that one, but you're gonna have all these people coming out making these kinds of videos because for some reason people watch this stuff for some reason people actually enjoy these kinds of videos where hey it's only been three hours literally in this case since this person has passed away tragically let's go ahead and hashtag pump a video out you know what I mean so uh, the unfortunate reality of this one is today Caroline Flack passed away now I uh I wasn't super familiar with this person beforehand but she has been on a slew of different shows like the X Factor I'm a celebrity get me out of here now uh, Love Island was was one of the more recent ones, unfortunately passed away due to suicide. This is something that has obviously upset a lot of people. I mean, it's tragic, man. Suicide is not something that anyone should ever have to deal with, even being like a, a fan of somebody or even, God forbid, being family of somebody who does something like this. It, it's a tragedy that affects people even who weren't actually the one who did it for the rest of their life. I mean, it, it's horrible, right? But not to the fucking people who get on YouTube and pump out, oh, we're gonna FaceTime them, bro, we're gonna FaceTime them kinds of videos, because what else can you do? What, what other kinds of videos can you make? Oh, literally an infinite amount of different possibilities? No, fuck it, we're, we're pulling this kind of video off, so. Oh my god. Let's go ahead and take a look, guys. Let's go ahead and see what people are up to now. Oh my god, guys, I have got Caroline Flack's number, and I'm gonna be proving if she is dead or alive. Yo guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, guys, basically I'm gonna be ringing Caroline Flack because apparently she is dead. Apparently she's been found dead in her house today. I've got Caroline Flack's number off the internet, so I'm gonna ring in that number, seeing if it's actually true, and seeing if she is dead or alive. Okay. Well, he's got her phone number, and he's gonna be proving if the person who tragically committed suicide is dead or alive. Is anyone else kind of understanding this? Kind of seeing the problem with this? Does anyone? understand the problem here or is it just me see i just made asmr content it is possible imagine that statement coming out of your mouth and you keep a straight face while recording this i just want everyone to try i want everyone to go ahead and and, and try to picture yourself doing this where you legitimately tell people hey uh it's unfortunate but this person committed suicide today but i got their phone number and I will be going ahead and calling them to see if they're dead or alive. I am convinced that you have to have something wrong with you mentally to make these kinds of videos. I am I am 100% convinced that something has to be like not wired properly in your head or something's going on there, right? It just doesn't make sense that people do this and, and just like they're supposed to be normal human beings. What normal human being makes a video like this? And by the way, let me go ahead and address the big blur on the screen because I know that people are going to be kind of confused about that. He plugged his Instagram as a fourth of the entire fucking video on screen. Literally does not take it off through the entire duration of the video. And I'm not giving this person clout. I'm not giving them any attention for this one. I'm not shouting them out. I'm not giving their name. I'm not giving the video name, nothing. We're not doing any of that. We're, we're gonna sit here and ridicule these people for pulling this off from a distance. See so guys, if you actually enjoyed this video, don't forget to go down below and smash that like button. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We are on the road to 35 subscribers. And once you hit that subscribe button, don't forget to turn the notifications on. It notifies you every time I do upload another banger of a video. And of course, man, before we we even really go into anything here we're literally just not even doing anything yet make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you enjoyed the content go ahead and turn on all notifications for the channel like bro just buy an animation or something you know this is pathetic. Hey everybody, we're gonna be uh, FaceTiming that celebrity who tragically committed suicide today, but make sure you smash that like button. If there isn't 47,000 likes on this video, I will not make another one, guys. There is no way I will ever make another one of these kinds of videos if we do not reach the like goal, so make sure that you're just blasting that like button. Make sure that you bend it over and just go to town on that like button, guys. We need 87 million likes on this video if we please could. And I even wanna point out 
that the like and dislikes are hidden on the video along with comments because he knew for a fact that this was going to get such a negative reaction that he did not want this information to be public. So what is the point in anyone hitting the like button on your video here, which, I mean, we could just end the sentence at that, and I think it would go ahead and fit what I'm trying to say here, but who wants to hit a like button when they can't even see how many likes are on the video? Hey guys, please give me free engagement on my video. I know you guys want to see how many likes there are, but I'm going to hide that because there's going to be 8,000 dislikes and 400 likes, so. Alright guys, so, I'm going to be turning my screen recording on right now, three, two, one. Okay, my screen recording is on, we are going to be actually seen if Caroline Flack is alive. Okay, not to be mean or anything, or like not to, I guess, uh, I don't know. But why is it that every time I watch one of these videos and we have to see this, they all look the exact same. Like, they, there's no difference whatsoever. They're always just some teenager with like a perm. I mean, well, there's no difference. Like, I think at this point, it's just like a personality thing. It's always just these high school aged kids with a perm, like, I understand you want the curly hair, man, I understand you want those curls to flow and you want your hair to look, you know, nice and shit, but bro, you just can't be us. I hate to say it, you just can't pull this off. I mean, this looks horrible, but they all look the exact same when they make these videos. It, it just, it, it's mind-blowing to me. I'm about to start FaceTiming whoever's doing their fucking perms, okay, so. Hello, Caroline, there's rumors. Rumors that you are dead. Is this true? Please let me know. Do a kiss, of course. So I've put hello, Caroline. There's rumors that you are dead. Is this true? Please let me know. And we've said that. Let's see if she got a flash reply. So I shouldn't even have to point this out. Obviously, this is not Caroline Flack that he's talking to, even though that's what the name would suggest. He just changed a different contact or whatever into to that name. But I also love how he can't spell worth a shit and it takes him 47 seconds to go ahead and type out like two sentences. Apparently it's just impossible. I, I, I don't know, but this is content, folks. This is content. Oh, she's typing. Who is this? Um, I'm gonna be putting, I'm a YouTuber called Joe. So, do I even need to point out that this is just disrespectful and it just, it's wrong to do something like this? Do I really need to tell you guys this? Or are we all kind of on the same page here? I, I'm, I'm not sure. Go ahead and let me know down below. Make sure you smash that like button and turn on notifications, guys. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. I put out a new banger of a video nearly every single day, guys. And it doesn't rely on me FaceTiming people who have recently passed away in tragic, tragic different events. I just want to know if you're dead or alive. I'm live, please pass spreading rumors, don't believe anyone in these days. He can't even speak! He can't even speak! I mean, I have issues talking sometimes. My sentences might run on a little bit longer than they should. I might use things like like to kind of, I guess, bridge my sentences just a little bit too often. But he can't even pronounce four letter words. Okay, four, five, six letter words are an issue to him. And he can't even use the, oh my god, I can't even use the correct forms of different words, man. Then again, I, I wouldn't say that he probably has an ex a very high IQ, okay? He, he's not, I would say, up there with uh, the muy intelligente folks, okay? He probably just thought I was speaking Italian if he's watching this video. So, let, I, you know what, let's, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. Oh my god, guys, Caroline's actually FaceTiming us right now, guys. Oh my god. Yo, Caroline, is that you? Are you alive, Caroline? Whoa, guys, can you believe it? I have a static image of a recently passed away celebrity on FaceTime with me now, and we are FaceTiming them, guys. Are you really alive? Are you alive? Like, dude, come on, man. What is wrong with you? I, uh, what is, what is your issue? I need to know. Do we have any doctors in the chat? Anyone, like a scientist who can study his brain and see what's going on up there, man? I, I just don't get it. I don't know if it's the perm that's affecting his mental decisions. I don't know what it is, man, but no, no.
you're not allowed to do this. I, I'm saying it now. You're not allowed to do this, okay? We're, like, you need a father to come in and tell you something. Here, let, let me sun you for a second. You're done, okay? You're done. I don't want to ever see another video like this ever again. I'm calling it now. Yo, what the frick, guys? Yo, whoa. Hello? Yo, I think Caroline's actually alive, guys. Oh my god. What the hell? Wow, guys, I really think she's alive, bro. I, I'm 100% convinced, man, she's gotta be alive, even though literally every news report has confirmed to this point that she has unfortunately, you know, passed away. But, man, I just faked an entire YouTube video where I FaceTimed a static image that my friend put up on this screen while he rumbles around in his room playing his PlayStation or something, man. Isn't that insane, guys? She's gotta be alive. She, she's gotta be alive. No other possibilities, guys. So, yeah, that, that's the end of the clip, but here, here's something that I find just really funny, man, okay? This guy had the gumption to go on Twitter and say, and all the hate begins. Because, yeah, you know, you were gonna get an extremely positive reception for making that kind of video, man. Like, people were just gonna show up and see what you did here, and your video was going to receive critical acclaim. I mean, you might have been nominated for, like, some sort of prestigious award for this content, brother. I can't wonder why people would ever send you hate after doing something like this, man. And no, I I'm not gonna drop his Twitter or anything like that. Like I said, I I'm not gonna give him that kind of attention. We'll, we'll snipe this one from a distance. We'll make fun of them, but we're, we're definitely not shouting out anything for them. And with that being said, guys, thank you for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new around here on my channel. Follow me over on Twitter at SubToptimus. I post memes, thoughts, and updates over there. Surefire way to get notifications on all my newest content. Make sure to check out Optube down below. Lots of great things going on down there. Thank you to my channel members. Your support helps my channel tremendously. And uh, by the way, uh, channel members, new FaceTiming your favorite celebrity is coming soon. So make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you're brand new, and uh, turn on all your notifications. That would be awesome. I put up new bangers every single day. And with all that being said, guys, this is Optimus with a perm signing out.